Hey there, good morning. I'm not gonna pretend it's tomorrow or whatever. Uh, today is Monday, July 1st, even though the video is coming out the day after. Um, so I sort of showed you this little guy, you can see how tiny it is, um, in yesterday's video. And to, this morning I'm just gonna show you real quick a bit of a flip through um, before I get started with my day. So it has four different sets of covers, um, but I have this one in the front. And so I, ha I have this in the front because this section is like my brain dump section. So my idea is to have this like next to me on my desk so I can jot down thoughts and stuff throughout the day. Um, this is also where I have just like all of my extra paper. I just printed a bunch of this grid paper. This is a freebie from Alibi Design Studio on Etsy. Um, I just found this, thought it was adorable, thought it was super convenient because basically I'm just sort of using a simple bullet journal system while I figure out what I think about this size. So then we have the next cover. This is my planning section. So I mentioned that this was like a 12 by 12 um, scrapbooking paper. So if you divide that, you know, up, you end up with three by four, which is the same size here. So I figured that was perfect. I just cut it out and stuck it in here as my little monthly calendar. Uh, but then I also have a monthly log. This is just the standard bullet journal style. It shows you, you know, what's going on each day continues on the next page. Obviously it's not big enough. <laughs> and then uh, this is sort of tasks that need to get done in particular weeks. So you have, yeah, 1 through 7, 8 through 14. Those are the dates of the week. So this month, uh, this week I have to remember to do the, um, the last month photo for my baby because she's turning a year old tomorrow and uh, to back up my videos on my computer. In the parentheses here, that's the week it is on MH, because um, I wanted to make sure I actually do have time to not worry this month about my podcast, because that starts uh, in August. I'll start working on that. Then on the back here, I have some trackers. Um, I can start filling that out a little bit. It, it's small. Um, and then this is supposed to be for my NFP chart and then this is how much of my phone data I've used. I get eight gigs of high-speed data every month um, but I want to save like five of them for Comic-Con so that I don't have to feel like I'm metering anything and I can just go wild. Um, <laughs> that's the idea so between the 25th and the 16th I'm trying to use three gigabytes so so far I'm only one gigabyte in and I have like a whole day before I yeah I'm good I'm, I'm doing good. Um, this then is an Alistair Weekly. Not a lot of space. I gave a block for each day of the week and that only leaves four blocks for the actual task. But the idea here is to put tasks that I want to get done this week and then assign a day to them. Then the back of that is for more tasks if I need more. And then we've got some dailies because I, I, I thought about not using dailies but then I ended up making a daily because I always just find it more helpful to have everything in one place. So I put a little flag here so that I can get to it quickly and easily even though I have the brain dump in the front. And this cover is on backwards and I need to redo it but you will see on this to-do list remake cover. Um, so yeah, I punched it on the wrong side. Anyway, this is just a general to-do list, and then I think that's all in here. So I'm still kind of getting a feel for like how I want it all to be laid out, uh, what sections are for what, because I'm trying to keep this super simple, um, because I'm, I guess I'm trying to, like I said, kind of clear my head and get just a couple things done, be ready for the party this weekend, which speaking of, this section is for the party. These are tasks that need to get done before Saturday. Just a general list. So I'm taking from this list and putting them on this like six day, you know, Monday through Saturday. Um, so the things in brackets here, like on um, on the 4th, we're going to be going to a party at a family's house. So we're I'm basically discounting that whole day. I'm going to be doing a lot of baking on Friday, but I'm going to try to get some stuff done on Wednesday with the chocolate pretzels so that I have less to do on set on Friday and then today I have some paper cutting to do and the next day I'm going to focus on getting the baby book wrapped up and then this is the list of things I need to bring to the party and then this is another project separate project this project hello micro day one that's this um, these are just my daily videos 
Um, and then that's an extra piece of paper. And that's what I've got here. So I'm going to go on with my day, figure out how this works for me, and then come back and show you in the evening um, what I thought because I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave this at home and just work out of this. So I'll see ya. Sorry about all the fan noises, but I can recommend the Parmesan crusted chicken recipe on the side of the Best Foods mayonnaise container or Hellman's if you're in that part of the country. Um, today has been pretty good. I'll tell you all about it in a minute. But first, this is a baby who really loves rice. So I used this thing all day. And when I say used, basically it sat near me, but I didn't, I don't, I don't know, I referred to it. Um, I added tabs. These are the only tabs I have are these post-it flag things. Um, in an ideal world, I'd have like, cut off the blue, but I just didn't get around to it because reasons. I don't know. I was just, it was a really crazy day at work. And so, you know, I just kind of have been done. So let's take a look at my daily here. Um, I always have to make sure that I get the Whenever we're on antibiotics, got to put them on the planner so that you don't forget a dose. So we took dose 9 of 20 this evening. My baby is on amoxicillin. Uh, paid the babysitter, which is good. So I can cross that off. Oh, I already did. Then I didn't do this. I might I might do this uh, after, like, while well, my video is rendering or something. This item I tried to do. Um, but it turns out I need more information, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to migrate it to this section of this to-do list, um, but I'm going to make a, I don't really want to call it a someday maybe list, but like maybe just a later go. Exclamation point means it's fun. Uh, I'm gonna just give a little bit of a color stripe because that's how I do. And add it on here. So basically this is something that I thought would be easy to get done, um, you know, within 15 minutes or so. Turns out I need more information than I thought. Um, I have to track something down. And so it's not gonna happen this week and I'm gonna be in a different planner but it's, it's probably, I, I don't think I'm going to be in here next week. So I'm just putting it on a different spread and I will know to look there when it's time to find it. Um, and then this is what I'm doing right now. So I'm going to leave my daily as is, with everything else crossed off and just set up tomorrow's real quick. It's a seven, two, Indented it. These things matter to me that it's like uniform. Tomorrow is Agnes's birthday. I can't believe it. So, um, I don't know what needs to get done. Let's look here first at our monthly log. It just says birthday. We're having people over for dinner, so I do need to make sure everything's tidied up and stuff. I'm going to do some of that before bed tonight, obviously. Uh, let's see. Back up videos. That's not going to happen tomorrow. Let's see. So I don't even know. What else? I guess the uh, prescription. She takes it once in the morning. And once in the evening. Let's see what else is on here that needs to be recurring. Not particularly. Alright, I think it's one of those days I'm going to leave this pretty sparse. I'm going to put like tidy. And put an arrow there. And then just 
birthday dinner, I guess I'll call it. My husband's picking up Chinese takeout and a cake and his parents and grandfather are coming over for dinner. The big party is on Saturday, but we're just, you know, having a little get together, giving her a slice of cake and having fun. So if I end up with extra time, which I don't foresee, but if I do, I will look either at uh, let's see, this spread or this spread. It's occurred to me now, I didn't look and I definitely do need to take her picture tomorrow. Sorry, I keep slipping off the camera. And I'm remembering now also, uh, let's see the project section here, that I was going to work on the baby book. Yeah, that'll actually be kind of fun. Maybe I can work on the baby book while people are here. You know, like after dinner. That'd be cute. Alright, so that's the thing. Um, I don't know how, oh, how much I have to say about this. It sat next to me at my desk. Um, I had it open to my brain dump page, which you'll see I didn't use. There were a couple of things I thought of, but I ended up just adding them like to my to-do list, I think, um, or like my daily, and not here, because like the only things that were on my brain when I was at work was work stuff, and then since I've been home, it's all just you know dinner and bedtime and all that. So. Anyway, it's, uh, it's working for what it is, I guess, so far so good, and I will see you guys tomorrow um, for, my goodness, my little baby's birthday. See you then. Bye.